They became the first ever father-son duo to play in the NBA. They played just three minutes together, but the moment will last in history forever. So our senior NBA insider, Sham Sharanya, is joining us now as the Lakers prepare for their second game of the season. Shams, there was so much excitement here to finally see the first father-son duo play in the NBA. Now that that special moment has happened, what can you tell us about Bronny's plans for future development here? The Lakers play tonight. They play tomorrow against the Sacramento Kings. Then they go on a five-game road trip that starts next week. And Bronny James will be on that trip. And that includes a momentous game, potentially, on Wednesday in Cleveland, a right. homecoming for LeBron James and Bronny James, and he's a, he will be on this trip. Could he play? We'll see. And then after that, I am told he will begin his shuttle from the NBA to the G League. He will be assigned to South Bay uh, that week of November 7th when the G League season starts. And for him and Rich Paul, the big aspect of Bronny James throughout the pre-draft process was his development, and he was not afraid. They welcomed going to the G League. That was a part of it. The big question was, was it going to be a two-way contract or a guaranteed deal? He gets that four-year contract, three of those years guaranteed. And Malik, I've done some digging on his marketing. This is someone that if he wanted to, let's say he doesn't want to play basketball, he could make more money off his off-court deals in marketing and just be an influencer. But he wants to be an NBA player, and this G League path is a part of that. It's something LeBron, we've heard him talk about. Bronny talk about JJ Redick, talk about the importance of this for Bronny James. And now we're going to see when the G League season starts. The South Bay Lakers' first game is November 9th. Bronny James will be going back and forth. All right, Shams, thank you for